So the Subjunctive SMG is part of the Undying Weapon set that has returned in Season of the Wish. And this SMG is one of the best ARC SMGs that we have in the game. It's basically on the same level as the Aikilos SMG. It just has a faster RPM. This is a 900 RPM. And you can get this from Riven's Lair. Oil, you can use your Riven's Engrams at Riven and focus this SMG as well. You can also get them from the Starcrossed mission. Every clear that you get does give you an Undying Weapon, as well as you get one Red Border on Normal. And I believe two on Legend, you get two Red Borders. I honestly don't remember for sure if I've gotten two Red Borders guaranteed from the mission on Legend. But I know you do get one of each for Normal and Legend. There's also three secret chests that you can loot right now in the mission itself that will also give you a weapon. So if you want to have the best farm for the Undying Weapons, in my opinion, I would say just farm the mission on Normal. Or just use your Riven Engrams at Riven and focus this SMG. You do need to get five red borders in total in order to craft it. So getting into the role that I like on this weapon. I like Hammer Forge Rifling because it does lack range. In the magazine, I like Flared Mech for the faster reload speed because you are going to need to reload this weapon as fast as you can to proc Bolt Shot, which I'm going to talk about in a second. The first perk slot, there's options like Shoot to Loot with Shooting and Orb of Power. We'll pick it up or shooting a weapon. Brick will also pick it up, but... I don't really find myself needing shoot to loot, especially with an SMG. There's also Grave Robber, which melee final blows will reload this weapon from reserves. I want to manually reload this weapon to proc volt shot, so I'm not going to want Grave Robber. There's Threat Detector, which is a top option for this. Increase reload, stability, and handling when enemies are in a close proximity. In order to proc this, you do have to have enemies around you, which in low run content, when you're using an SMG, you're most of the time you're going to have enemies around you. So that's what makes it a really good option. I like Stats for All, which hitting three separate targets will increase weapon handling, stability, reload, and range for a short duration. So no matter if there's enemies, Close to me, far away from me, I can still proc stats for all as long as I hit three separate enemies within three seconds of each other. And then for that 10 seconds, I get 10 stability, 35 handling, 10 range, and then the 35 reload speed as well, which is going to go great with Vault Shot. So I don't have to get any kills to proc that. So that's why I like stats for all, because even if I don't get a kill to proc Vault Shot, which I mean, most of the time with an SMG, you're going to get a kill anyway, as long as I hit three separate enemies... I'm still going to have all these buffs to the weapon anyway. There's also subsistence, which defeating targets will reload the magazine from reserves. I don't really like that because once again, to proc Volt Shot, you have to manually reload the SMG. Using something like Grave Robber and subsistence won't proc Volt Shot. So that's why I like Stats for All the most on this. So in my opinion, I choose Stats for All or Threat Detector. Those are going to be the two options to pair with Volt Shot. And what Volt Shot does is reloading this weapon after feeding a target will overcharge the weapon for a short period of time, and you will jolt the enemy on its next hit. So, Bolt Shot is going to be good. It can stun overloads. It is good for, you know, keeping stuff active with your arc builds. I mostly would use this with an arc build, but you can use this just in general anyway. The stats for all Bolt Shot roll, or really just Bolt Shot in general, is always going to be useful, especially in lower run content where it's really good for chaining to ads and clearing them. I want to reload speed mass work because, once again, I'm going to have to reload this weapon as fast as I can to proc Volt Shot. So I want to be constantly reloading this weapon over and over and over and proccing that Volt Shot. And that's pretty much what I like on the Subjunctive SMG. Um, once again, Hammer Forge, Flared Mag, Stats for All, Volt Shot is going to be the role that I want the most on this. You can also go Threat Detector, which is going to be a really good option as well. This is what I like on this SMG. Let me know what you're looking for on it. And if you are having a hard time getting your red orders for it, because a lot of people are at the beginning of the season, hopefully... You're able to craft it, or you will be able to craft it soon. See you in the next one. Peace.